Well, hey there everybody, how y'all doing? I hope everybody's having a wonderful day or night, and welcome back to my channel. As always, I'm Deluxe. Alright, let's do another freaking Transformer review, because I love some freaking Transformers. Today we'll be taking a look at Legacy United, this is Deluxe Class G1 Universe Autobot Gears. Alright, look at that. He does come with the chest piece, it is separately. I know a lot of people know that by now, but just thought I'd say that. Beautiful artwork as always, on the side, looks good. On the back, 12 steps to transform. There you go in car mode and in bot mode. Like I said, he does come with the chest piece. And there you go. And there you go. And there you go. All right, let's see what he comes with. All right. Yay. All right, as always, instructions. And once again, Hasbro, good job. Pretty big pictures, easy to follow. Good stuff. All right, like I said, he does come with the chest that comes off. Uh, just tabs in with little nubs, whatever. You just push them in. Got nice silver paint, Autobot symbol, like it, looks good. And he comes with a blaster, yeah, very nice, I like it. Got a little waffles there, but nice sculpt work, just black plastic. And there you go, all right. Whee, all right, here is Gears from Legacy United. Okay, so first things first, when I first saw this, I didn't think I was gonna like the alt mode, I thought it was gonna be ugly and everything, but once I got it in hand, it's not terrible. You know, it's not terrible at all. Um, it does got some good paint and everything. This whole red bumper is painted red. You got the silver. You got the yellow silver right here. Nice Autobot uh, sticker right there. Temple sticker right there. Silver paint. The windows are painted nicely blue. I got a little scratch on mine right there. That kind of sucks. Um, don't like the wheels. They're, you know, I hate the mushroom pig, but at least they're all four, you know, the correct way. You know, instead of, you know, these two is back different from this. So had to give them that a little bit. I don't still, I still don't like the uh, mushroom uh, pegs, but you know, at least they're all together. Um, and I guess you can call it a lift. I didn't think I was gonna like the space in between this, but you know, it's a lift truck, I guess. So that's pretty cool. Um, you know, this area is kind of weird looking, but you know, and this is kind of weird too. <laughs> you know, you got the chest. You know, I kind of wish they would have found a figure out to uh, find a way to put it on the bottom, so it wouldn't be there. So it'd be like the original G1. Um, so you know, that's kind of a miss, but. Uh, you do got some five millimeter ports right here, right here, up here at the top, so you can arm them up and everything. So very nice. Underneath, you see it. You can turn that, you know, head around if you don't want to see that. But you know, they're laying. Um, these do kind of. They don't lock into place. Um, it's not heavy, you know, so it won't, you know, bolt, you know, bulge out or anything like that. Uh, rolls just fine. This is a smooth surface, so you know, but it will roll just fine. But overall, not terrible. You know, not the best looking alt mode, but you know, it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be whenever I saw it in pictures. That's pretty cool. Um, like I said, you can take the gun. Um, you can, you know, store it up here. You know, that's where, probably where I'm going to put it, you know, mainly if I want to, you know, like that. Do that. You know, you can put it right there. You know, in the instructions, they do it, they do it right there. So, you know, however you want to see, you know, that does kind of, it will fold in a little bit once in a while. So just be wary of that. And you can put it right there too if you want to. So that's cool. All right. So that is Gears in his alt mode and it's not the you know not terrible you know it's fine and as always there's uh wheelie you got magic square prowl you got prime for new age you got red alert and then dustbuster jazz scale All right, back for transformation. Here is Gears. I think it looks pretty cool. 
like I said, I, I, he's grown on me. You know, I, I do like the bot mode a lot better than the alt mode, but here he is. Nice head sculpt. Got the bucket head going on. Silver, nice blue eyes. Looks really good. I like that. Articulation, you got a little down, not much. The chin gets in the way. Then you get a little up, you know, nothing right home about, but it's there. Now you can go all the way around, but you will start, you will knock into this part so you can untie it a little bit so you can get the full range around and you got a little wiggle waggle, a little attitude and everything. So that's cool. Love the chest, got nice, you know, I shall get that the nice silver paint and everything, a little red paint. All right, as far as the arm, you can go up to there, 90 degrees, all the way around. You do have a butterfly, and that's awesome. I really hope they do this more often. I like that. They gave it, uh, Cybertron Starscream had a um, nice butterfly, so that is cool. It just causes transformation, but it's still there. I like that. Um, all the way around, I already said that. All right, got the nice elbow bend, got all the way, that's nice, I like that. You do have a bicep swivel as well and a swivel of the hand so very nice everything good all right like i said you do have this gimmick you know that one time he's in the cartoon so i think they put a floppy disc in there i think it was uh would have been nice if they would have painted it silver but you know make it pop a little bit that would have been cool but you know you do got some nice sculpt work in there that's cool uh but been cool to do that and uh, i wish they would give him a smiley face too as well because you know made him happy instead of grumpy that would have been cool to add in a smiley face that would have been awesome but that's a little too much to ask for hasbro all right waist swivel very nice. They could have gave him an ab crunch too as well, but no ab crunch. Van Dam all day, every day. I like how the hips go with it. Kick up, kick back, uh, thigh swivel. Nice knee bend. Very good. I like that. Uh, no tool tilt up or down, but you do have a nice rocker. So very nice. All right. Lots of scope work in there. Um, also like, you know, with this gimmick here, I like that they threw in the M. I forgot what that meant. I know it's on the G1, but I forgot what that meant for the M. Somebody will tell me in the comics, but they threw that in right there. That is pretty cool. That's a nice little little nod. Usually it was on the top of the hood, uh, but it's not there. But I like that. I like I, that's pretty cool they threw that in. Uh, he does have a backpack. You know, it's not terrible, but it is, it is there in the back or anything. And you know what else? No waffles, really. I mean, you got a little bit right there, not much. I don't consider this a waffle, um, you know, stuff there. But, you know, arms are good. Yeah, that's good. I mean, come on now. Hasbro, you can do that. You can really do that. All right. With the gun, you can put it in your hand if you want. Um, you know, it fits good. It's a little tight. You know, just be wary of that. But, you know, it fits in there. And you, uh, you have a 5 millimeter port right here and on the other side. And you have one right here on the back, too, as well. So you can add the gun right here if you want. You can hold it or you can move it down. Kind of wish that tab done a little better. Uh, you can move it down, too, as well. So you can have weapon storage so that is pretty cool so yeah that is about it so there you go all right real quick i like to show what uh you can do with shard uh, you can take her parts she is a female and you can you know you know just mess around and make some stuff up and everything this is on the back of her box uh where you've got the kind of the bow you know the crossbow thing going on you got this kind of weapon too um you got these two as well they're so they show it on her box that so they go right here but i can't get you know there's the um uh wheel well whatever that is doesn't it doesn't really let it you know stick in there so kind of you know kind of gets in the way so i don't know how they did that but you can use these as you know like boots or something whatever you know i don't know and you can take the arms and then you can just arm him up and just have fun the playability is right there that is awesome so you can do that and that's pretty cool i like it well, there you go you can do what you there's what you can do with shard and there is Siege Optimus Prime. You got Ironhide and Sideswipe. And you got his good old buddy uh, Braun. You got Core Class Wheelie. And you got Tiss McGee Redgar. Scale. And Crapagon has crappy toilet paper, Triple A Barry, Carmex, Care Bears, Kicker, and Squeaks. More scale. Well, hey there, everybody. If you made this far, as always, I appreciate that. All right. Final thoughts on Legacy United G1 Gears. Pleasant surprise. I really like this guy. I didn't think I was when I first saw him. I thought he was going to be terrible. But man. Really grew on me. I really like him. Um, now, the alt mode, the truck mode is kind of the weakest. Um, I don't like that they put the chest on the back of it. Kind of wish they would have found a way to leave it underneath the bottom or something like that. That would have been pretty cool. Um, and I thought the uh, you know the uh, lift of the tires was going to bother me, but it's not terrible at all. But just be wary that um, you know they do kind of bulge out a little bit. He's not a heavy bot, but um, if you do start messing around with him, it'll start to bulge out a little bit. Uh, giggity. Uh, but other than that, I, you know, it's fine. You know, truck mode's fine. Um, transformation really like I like the engineering I love how they got the tires up here instead of going on the legs like on the side like they usually do um, that's really cool but yeah transformation is fun and engineering is really cool bot mode I really like I mean I didn't think I was going to but it really it really grew on me man 
Love taking pictures of him. Got some good pictures, I think. Uh, I like the gun. It's pretty cool. You can use glass effects with it. That's pretty cool. He does have, you know, five millimeter ports. Uh, so you can add on shard if you want to and some other stuff and weapons and everything. That's pretty cool. Paint wise, um, it's decent. You know, he's got some good on the chest. The head sculpt is nicely painted. Now in truck mode, it does have some good paint. You got the uh, red right here. You got the Autobot symbol and everything. That's pretty cool. Um, kind of there's a lot, you know, no paint really on the legs, you know, from the waist below. A lot of, you know, plastic. Um, I wish they would have painted the inside. You know, it's a nice little gimmick. You know, it's pretty cool for that one episode. But it would have been cool if they would put painted silver, and that would have brought that out and everything. Love that they put the M on the back of his head. That's pretty cool. Nice little nod to that. Like I said, I forgot what it meant. Uh, if you do know what it is, hit me in the comments and everything. Articulation, really good. Really. I mean, the head sculpt, you know, you have to, it does run in the back of it, and it will, you know, make it bulge out a little bit. Uh, but he's got a butterfly. You know, he's got everything normally with the legs he does. I mean, the only thing he really needs is a app crunch and um but yeah overall really well materials feel good i i really like this guy i really didn't think i was going to like him but he's grown on me and i i really i recommend him he's pretty cool so hit me up some like share prayers and care bears hit that sub button for me if you don't mind it really helps out the channel and uh hit me up some comments let me know the review you're getting this guy i think he's gonna go well with the uh you know the rest of your g1 mini bots and everything so i guess i'll see you in the next transform review and as always good be good to yourself Hell freaking Transformers and Hell freaking Gears, man. This is, he might go in my top 10. I, I really feel like he might be in my top 10. I like it. I really do. What's up, everybody? Oh, they, I wish they would have gave him a head sculpt, too, uh, a smiley face, too, as well, to go with the little, uh, you know, this um, gimmick right here. That would have been pretty cool. But, you know, they never really get out new head sculpts. But, anyways, um, what's up, everybody? My name's Gears. I don't know who you are. How you doing? Are you happy or are you grumpy? Well, they put that little disc in me and I'm happy. Happy, happy, happy. Now, Happy Gilmore. Oh, well, that's good. Yeah, see, I'm not going to kick the baby. I want to pet the baby. Hey, pet the baby. Pet the baby. Screw you, Alpha Bravo. You owe me money. I remember you. Just because they put something in me, they don't mean I remember. Yeah. Well, yeah, he deserved that. Yeah, he owes a lot of people money. What's up, Shocky? I'm good. What's up, Dirt Fire? Hey, what's up, Jeep Gears? How you doing? Pooper Scooper? You're just sitting over there, just laying down on the job, you know? What he does, man. All right. Floor time. You gotta love it. Good night, folks.